Hey, what's up, guys? This is Game Guy, and this is actually a random top video. I actually thought about this the other day because I was watching Fly. Wait, no, not Fly Boys. I was watching Red Tails. If you haven't watched Red Tails, it's actually a movie about an Afri African American like aviation camp or whatever. And they're these guys. They call themselves the Red Tails, and they flew planes in the World War II era and they didn't really get a chance they were actually the first like black pilots to actually you know participate in dog fights or whatever in the war in World War II and it's actually a pretty good movie but I've, I've always been a big fan of like airplanes and World War II like airplane era battles or whatever I watched Pearl Harbor, Flyboys, Red Tails what else is there the Red Baron and just a bunch of different World War II era like airplane movies and I really enjoyed them and one of the big reasons I enjoy playing like Grand Theft Auto is because of the aircraft believe it or not like you can do all sorts of different things but I, I really enjoy like flying in an airplane or a helicopter and as you're seeing in this gameplay now it's actually a game I have called Blazing Angels 2 uh, secret missions of World War II and I'm actually doing a mission I think it's the 11th 10th or 11th mission and I've, this is one of the games I've been working on beating if you watch my commentary yesterday the I'm back commentary I actually talked about all the games that I've been working on and Blazing Angels 2 is one of the games that I'm working on now trying to beat but what I really wanted to talk about is like airplane games and how they should try to make some really good airplane games like for next gen and like for current gen as well but well actually current gen is next gen but previous gen like PlayStation 3, Xbox 360 and then for the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One like they haven't really ever made a really good airplane game although I do have a little bit of fun playing Blazing Angels 2 it's not that good of an airplane game and I feel like they've never like actually executed and made a really good airplane game especially like World War II era airplane games because those are really fun like flying in the air and shooting down other airplanes that's like epic you know one of the dreams that I had when I was a little kid was being a pilot you know I'm not really I don't really want to be a pilot like in real life but I dreamed about being a pilot but not for like a career or anything I just imagine flying and everything and thought it'd be really cool although I wouldn't probably do it now because you know <laughs> I don't really want to get up in the air and be like oh crap ah, and just crash or whatever but uh, it's actually a really cool thing you know flying in the air and then shooting down other enemies and I feel like they've never made a really good game and I think you know they should try to attempt to make a really good game uh, based on like World War II eras like really good graphics um, a really compelling story mode and then also probably a multiplayer similar to Call of Duty where you do like 6v6 dogfights or something in a certain area probably like inside of a bit like a huge arena <laughs> like a giant arena and you can actually slow down the paint planes and everything or like in a city area but it has like a big dome above it so you can't leave certain parts or go way off into the distance you know, it keeps you in an enclosed space so you can get a lot of kills, but I think that'd be pretty fun. But I don't think they've never, you know, ever made an actual really fun airplane game. And it's one of the things that I've enjoyed. I know I said that probably a hundred times already. I'm still trying to get back into making good commentaries because I've been away from this for so long. And I just have to, you know, pretty much say what I think. You know, I don't really have anything scripted or anything, so whatever pops in my head, I just say it. And I don't really want to leave, like, blank spaces where I'm like, and okay, and okay. You know, I don't want to leave, you know, empty spaces in my commentary, so you have to hear silence for, like, a couple of seconds. <laughs> but, like I said, I don't really think they have made a really good airplane game, and I think um, one way that they can make it a really cool airplane game is change a lot of the camera angles like a first person point of view inside of the actual airplane and then 
also where you can see the whole airplane third person and you know really do high detail graphics on the ground as well because you know although the sky may look great if you look down on the ground everything just looks like crap even the characters like running around on the ground sometimes you can see people on the blazing angels game but it's kind of fun to me to be honest the game is but i don't feel like it's super fun you know i can't do those cool moves like in the movies where they're flying behind you and you like pull back on the thrust and you flip, do like a flip over them and come behind them and just blow their tail off and they're like Ow, boom <laughs> But anyways, that's just something I had in mind. I don't really have any like details or anything on how they could actually make a really good airplane game. I just feel like they haven't really made a good airplane game. And I hope someone does in the future because those are some really fun games to mess around with or own from time to time. So anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I know it wasn't that great of a video, but... I'm still trying to get back into the commentary groove. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.